Hello, I'm meteorologist Sabrina Fine on what has been another soaker. So far this uh, day, we've seen almost an inch of rain out over toward White Marsh, over half an inch of rain into Bel Air, and it continues. In fact, showers remain in our forecast on our Monday, along with much colder temperatures. Taking a look at the satellite radar, this really from about the last six hours. Notice the good chunk of the activity has now begun to shift further to the northeast. But wait, watch what's happening in the corner of your screen. Our next round of rain coming our way, most likely arriving by tomorrow morning and I think that this next band is actually going to continue to increase in intensity. You can see a low pressure system out over toward Missouri. That is in fact going to be our mechanism for tomorrow, thus leading to a chance of thunderstorms as well. Right now we'll call it for a 100% chance of precipitation with a 20% chance of some thunderstorm activity for your Monday. Breaking down the timing, here's your future cast. So tomorrow at 6 a.m., look, just a few light showers for the north half of Baltimore as well as moving into Hagerstown. By the time we get closer to around 8.30, now covering a good chunk of the northern half of the county, by 9 o'clock, some points of yellow here, so a little bit heavier rain coming on down. I think the heaviest will approach our area between 1230 and 1 o'clock. We pause this here for you at 130. You're eating your lunch and you can see out along Haverty Grace dealing with some of the stronger showers there, uh, plus all over toward Chestertown. Baltimore forecast to see the lighter rain by the time we get to the end of the lunch hour, and I think we'll get a little bit of a break for your commute on home. We're not completely done with it, though, so for the evening on Monday, stay a 20 to 30 percent chance of rain. Now, by the time we get to Tuesday, day, a little more sunshine and about a 30% chance of an afternoon shower and finally starting to see temperatures or uh, the uh, rain come to an end once we get through right around your Wednesday. So for tonight, 47 degrees. That's fairly cool. It'll be cold, wet. There could also be a little bit of haze in the sky, not only for tonight, but even through tomorrow. Temperatures struggling, only 57 degrees. Now normally we're about I'd say the low 70s, so almost 15 degrees cooler than normal for this time of year. 7 day forecast, 57 tomorrow and rainy. We continue that chance of precipitation on our Tuesday as well. Wednesday finally drying out, temperatures allowing to warm up. And check out the forecast for Saturday. 80 degrees. Now this is Preakness guys, mostly sunny skies. There is a chance that the high pressure building that's going to bring us that warmth may not be as strong and we could see some showers. So still a few days away and as a result, we'll continue to watch um, for that to see how we have to tweak your forecast for you. Okay, stick with us online at WMAR2news.com for updates on top stories and breaking news. Also for news and weather while you're on the go, download the WMAR2 app in the App Store. You can watch live breaking radar and get breaking news sent straight to your phone. Thanks for watching. This WMAR2 news update is sponsored by Jones Junction.